Hello YouTube and today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to mod several things on your Xbox 360 and today right, the first thing you're going to need, you're going to need modding tools, I shall put several links in the description on several places where you can get it right, the first things you might want is right, sorry, right Sjet GT, this is to mod your COD Modern Warfare 2 or your COD 4 Game attack and um, free game matter does not work, just makes your profile really laggy. I've been deleting all the games. Uh, P25, this is profile editor, this is um, yeah, achievements and stuff. Profile editor, that's a different profile editor. USB, this is uh, how to hack your if you don't have an export and you're using a USB method. You do it with this, and the second thing is this. This is where you like sort of like patch all the stuff, and then COD tool. This is how you mod COD World War. This does not work, so I've already tried several times. Hex, so you don't need that. Horizon. This is another it's a bit like Modio, where you can get loads of mods for games and stuff, which probably are all patched by now. Right. Right. The first thing you're gonna need is you're gonna need your profile, and I'm gonna be showing you how to do that next right let me just pause that hello this is part two right there we all know about the new update where you can get flash usbs or adapters to work on the xbox 360 like so and pretty much that's where you're going to put your files and the first thing you need to do is you're going to have to set it up just going to turn the controller and you want to go down to system settings you want to go down to memory and you know this there's a USB storage device there. You're going to click on that and you're going to go configure now or for me. You, I'm going to select how much. Could just make it quicker. I'm going to make 512 megs for the Xbox on that. Okay, take a few minutes. So, blah, 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 blah. Oh, come on. The reason I'm doing this is go to set up my catch card and plus that thing right the device is now ready to use so it meets xbox standards you're now going to go into hard drive you're going to get your gamer profile for me that's ksi trevs yeah add me if you want i do modded stuff all right you want to copy that over to your usb so you're going to go move you're going to go yes and it's going to sign you out if you're signed in you're going to leave it to that no mistake that's all you need to do in this step so please keep watching Hi YouTube, I'm back with my profile. It's plugged in. When it's plugged in, you want to go into your modding pro mod profiles or whatever. And you want to go to USB X Stuff Explorer. You want to double click the app. If sometimes you might have to run it as an administrator. Right, this is where you're going to go now. This is where it's all your data stored. You can't do this by going into your memory sticks. You're going to go open device, and there's your content. You're going to go open that. Right, this is your profile. So don't change any of the folder names or any of the profiles because it's gonna affect your profile and it probably just corrupt it and probably ban you so you wanna go and extract that to your desktop or wherever you wanna same name of course that'll take pretty quick and that's done so there's your profile right there right now you wanna right, depending on what you wanna do show you wanna go modding tools so right, for this one I'm gonna be showing you how to alright let's no, this video is. I'll show you how to edit your thing, your your name on Modern Warfare 2 or any other one of those. You want to go to SGT 2.2, and you've probably seen this from other videos. And I'm going to very kindly do this for free, or you can do that little extra. And you're going to go to Open. This is going to open your profile, and you're going to go down to your desktop or wherever you saved it. There's that. You're going to couple click over it and again. And there's your file. Open that, and as you can see, KSI Travis is right there. And depending on what you want, so let's do. If you do something nice, so let's do. Uh, you can add buttons. You don't need to change any of these unless you know what you're doing. Uh, X B X Y. Travis. Uh, I'll be da, 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 da. Right, as you can see, I want that one. And then you're gonna go save. Right, this is going to make a hacked profile. It's not going to edit the profile in any way, which is kind of cool. And as you can see, when I save, 
I don't see that now. There's another profile. Right, you can now delete that because you're not going to need that. So you now want to put that back into your memory stick using X stuff, Explorer. You want to go File, Open Device, Content, and you want to inject folder. And as you can see, there it is. There, inject it. How do you want to? Cancel that. Right, that's done now. Right, this is important. Exit that, and you got to remove device safely. Whatever I can find it. Whenever you hack something, you always got to do this, okay? So, eject it. Give it a while. Yep, you can now remove it. It's come to part two. And remember, five stars. Thank you. Oh, oh there's the video. Hello YouTube, I'm back, uh, this may be part 2, right, uh, you want to get your memory stick, I'm using something different but otherwise, it doesn't have to be, as long as it's working, right, uh, ignore the message there, it's just saying, right, you plug it in with your hack profile, okay, and we'll read it, and I'm doing this with one hand, sometimes it won't work, there you go, uh, as you can see, memory unit, you've got gamer profiles, you've got your original profile, which will say corrupted, don't worry, and you've got your hacked profile, that's the important one. Okay, so now whenever you, right, so we want to move these back to your hard drive, so these, uh, we'll take a minute. And you also want to move this. That. Okay. So now you have your hack profile. You're gonna to go to your dashboard. And what you wanna do, you wanna go you wanna sign out of your original non-hacked. Alright, so it's corrupted but it really isn't, it's just because right, you wanna go sign to your profile. There's your hack profile. It will get some error screens. I see you want to do that idea. Yeah, right. And you want to go play your game. This is Modern Warfare 2. Alright, you want to skip all this. Right, you because you just signed into your hack profile, I believe. Right, you're gonna you have to do this every time by the way. Sorry about that yet, so you go through these settings. Okay. Okay. Accept these. Continue. Continue. No, I will not be offended. As you know. You go to this. You go to go to multiplayer. I'm not signing text was live. And you select wherever your stuff is, your content. Go to Xbox Live. Right. And now this time you get an error message saying that your profile isn't right. So you're sign normally on KSI Travs, I'm not gonna do it because it won't work full stop or connect to Xbox Live. And then it'll take a little it take a while, not more time than usual, and then it'll go it'll flick a bit and then it'll go into your hack spell file. Okay? Actually I'm gonna connect to Xbox Live I'll be with you for your second. I can swing you wanna to go to Xbox Live you get a current profile is not allowed to play on Xbox Live direct you to this screen and you're going to select your normal profile which is KSI and sign in as a normal and it will start to flicker as you can see go to Xbox Live and there you go XB, XY, Travs left bumper, right bumper select start and as you see uh, sometimes it doesn't let you join games you can join session in progress it takes a while to join a game. So I'll just give you a demonstration. It's got all your account stuff. Alright, uh, it's got my banks. Either boards, it's got my friends. Excuse me. Work. Thank you. And don't leave comments about saying this isn't proper or anything. If you don't want to do it, then don't leave comments again. Okay?